Apollo, Houston. Apollo copies. We're reading 80 in the cockpit. Healing and pressure will be going down to 1500. Copy, 1500. Okay, main bus tie is going on. A is on. B is on. Check, AC1, main A. AC1, main A. Power has now been fed to the servos that operate engine gimbals. Okay, go ahead and start pitch one. One. Pitch one. Y'all one. Got it. BMAP mode. Three, rate two. Rate two. FDAI, 5015. All right. Minus 161. Got it. Plus 129. Apollo, you should be starting your engine burn. Copy, Houston. Proceeding to verb 99. Start your watch when we get ignition. One second, two seconds. How's every pressure's holding good? How's the drift holding? Drifting a little bit and roll. 40 seconds left to burn. Uh, EMS is counting down. We're in good shape. Pressure's holding. Helium is coming down nicely. All of the systems are go. 20 seconds left. Stand by. We maneuvered over a little bit, I think. Move it over. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Shut down. Thank you, Houston. You two were right down the tube. All right, don't make it weird. We're bringing the cabin pressure back to normal. Copy, Houston. <coughs> John, do you want us to bring in a medic? <clears throat> no, I'm fine. Start the next thermal test. Lieutenant Bull, one more? Lieutenant Bull, congratulations on your official crew announcement. Thank you. There were a lot of great pilots out there to choose from. I'm just glad they gave me the chance. Where do you see the program's next steps with your new class? Apollo 4 confirmed our all-up engine construction. Our next objective is the landing module. Uh, imagine after a few more runs of uncrewed missions, our focus will be landing a human on the moon. Is that a mission you want to be part of? Well, I've seen all the shots on television. I wish it could be me. Honestly, I never thought I was that close to getting in. I certainly would like to be the first man on the moon. You're not alone then. Isn't Lieutenant Armstrong being trained as the first to walk? There's a lot of excited whispers that are going around. Do you find it frustrating that he may be going to space twice before you go once? I plan on being ready when asked. Look, I think we're all in the same race here. Neil is a fantastic astronaut. He's a driven patriot. He's a close personal friend. I want to be real clear about this. When we go to the moon, I'm going to be celebrating that victory with my team. As brothers. Not as competitors. Gallery count. Over. Roger that. 2600. Approaching 3200. Uh, I'm missing my... Your vertical stabilizer for the tilt control. Huh. No wonder the other wives don't like you. You allowed to bring stuff back from the moon? We're bringing rocks back for research. But I'm sure I can sneak one on the module for you. You know, Mary Ellen mentioned that you and James got put on another training exercise this weekend. Mary Ellen, huh? Yeah. They sprung it on us last minute. But what about my double header this weekend? You know what? I can film an inning and we can watch it together afterwards. You know this next training exercise for the lunar lander? Unless I had a schedule for the excursion module. Hey, I can read out your protocol commands with you. I'm gonna need all the help I can get, bud. They're still running uncrewed launches. Are you planning to fly soon? Gotta be ready for the next phase. We can't just run computer programs. They can't just run back to crewed missions just because they have the guinea pigs to run the tests. This is a race for the United States. We intend to win. Works pretty well, although you have to be very patient with the uh, system. But it's it's really a great capability for us here. Um, and what are some of the more uh, exciting tasks your crew will be undertaking? You know, we have the uh, this new Soyuz coming up board with three crew members, and certainly getting uh, them up to speed. And uh, you know kind of uh, into the working routine up here is, is going to be exciting and is very important.
cheating on me again. Thank you. Mm -hmm. How could I possibly compete with her beauty? You're so close to getting to her. You know, if a woman was in charge, you'd already be hopping around up there. You mean if you were in charge? <laughs> Jeffrey's been meeting with Davis every day now for extra practice. Davis? His coach. Oh, right. Right. Yeah, he's a clear favorite for the whole city team. Yeah, well, you know, he takes after his daddy. Do you think that... Think of us as you're chasing after her. $30 billion program, and we're still fixing things with duct tape. Beautiful. Irwin, Bull, I'll keep this brief. The Apollo 15 launch is approaching, and while we've taken into account the next few Apollo launches, 15, as it stands, will be the lunar landing. And I want to see both of you on board. Bull, you would lead the mission. Irwin would be the pilot. What do you think? We'd be honored. So I'll keep you apprised of the details as the day draws closer. For now, carry on. John, can I keep you another second, please? So we've been monitoring your health, and we suspect you have a sinusitis infection. Now, it's nothing major. So I'm just going to ask you to take it slow for the next few days. John, you are one of our strongest pilots. And we need you in the air. Thank you, ma'am. I'll certainly do my best. Excellent. Dismissed. <coughs> Dad? Dad? Jeff, I'm working, bud. Well, I want to know if you wanted to work on the model tonight. Not tonight, Jeff. I got work to do. Oh. When do you think you'll have the time? I don't know. Maybe tomorrow? I keep saying tomorrow. Shut the door behind you. Depressurization is acceptable to use your overhead hatch dump valve in addition to or instead of your forward hatch dump valve to speed up depressurization of the cabin. Fellow Doppies, I swear they make this capsule smaller every time we get in. It's a good guess. Either that or you're just getting fat. Apollo, Houston, you ready? Houston, we are ready when you are. All right, initiating cabin depress. Apollo, Houston. Go ahead, Houston. Two things. Select a 10 degree dead band in your DAP in accordance with the procedures on Foxtrot 97 in your checklist. I understand. 10 degree dead band. Thank you. Second, we'd like to leave a display on the disky that is not room that's cycling. Command, hold on that. Bull, you okay? I'm fine. Apollo, you okay? I'm good, Houston. Command, I think John's oxygen has a leak. Negative, Irwin. His oxygen is reading functional. Cancel cabin depress. Apollo, what's going on? Cancel cabin depress. Canceling depress. Honey, I am so proud of you. Good job. Thanks, Mom. It was amazing. Yeah, it's all in that seventh inning. Uh, is that Dad? Uh, 
go get in the shower. We'll be right in. Okay. John? Is everything all right? You're not gonna let that stand, are you? I don't have a choice. I don't care whose choice it is. Just crank the car and we can drive down and talk Nancy, to somebody. Nancy, just stop. About... I can't fly anymore. I'm sick. Did the doctors tell you that, John? No, not yet. They're looking at my test, but I know my body too well. I just. You know what? You're in your head. Come inside and rest up. Come on. John, I don't recognize you. I could have given so much more. I sacrificed everything to be here. What am I supposed to do? I mean, this was everything. We left our home for this, and now it's going to amount to nothing? What do you mean, nothing? You're an astronaut. No, I'm not, Nancy. I'm a bird with no wings. And I ain't even met it yet. You know what? It's a shame. Because you don't even realize what you already have. This is my favorite movie too. I'm sorry, son. Uh, are we moving? Yeah. New adventures to be had. 
We're gonna spend some time with your granddad. What about the family? You and your mom are coming with me, son. I mean, the astronauts. They're your family. They're smart guys. They'll be fine. We'll keep in touch. We can write to them. Sometimes, Coach keeps me on the bench. I don't want to, but Mom says he does it so other kids can have a chance at the plate. Do any of them ever get a hit? Almost never. But I can't quit just because I'm on the bench. I do what's best for my team, and they do the same for me. That's the deal. Have I done that for you? I'm an astronaut's son. I hold up pretty well. They all love you because you're one of them. Your family. You know, this never was my favorite movie. I like that. Certain baseball one. So much more. Kennedy launch control We've just passed three minutes, 30 second mark in the count. The terminal sequencer has been armed and we are go. Launch operations manager Paul Donnelly just wished the crew good luck and Godspeed. Now 25 seconds. We have complete clearance to launch. We are go. 20. Fifteen seconds, guidance internal, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, ignition sequence start, engines arm, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, all engines running, launch commit, liftoff, we have liftoff at 9.34 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time. <laughs> 